Hey guys, it's Brandy from Mommy Loves FFNC coming to you today to show you how to make your own homemade baby powder. You're going to need these items that I have on my table. You're going to need a measuring cup. I use a half cup measure for my old salt shaker for the powder. A small mixing bowl with a spoon. All natural cornstarch. I got this from Walmart. I believe I paid maybe $1.50 for this box. And then any essential oil of your choice. I use lavender just because it's a calming uh, smell for the babies. So grab your ingredients and I'll show you what to do next. Alright guys, what you're going to do next is you're going to grab your box of cornstarch and you're going to measure out a half cup, which I have here. You're going to take and you're going to put this into your bowl. And yes, it can be quite messy, so just... Get it in there as good as you can. And then you're going to take your essential oil, which like I said, I'm using lavender. And I'm going to put about 10 to 15 drops into the powder and I'm going to mix it around. So I'll be right back to show you what that's going to look like. Alright guys, as you can see, I have put the essential oil into the powder. I'm just going to mix this up really, really well. Sometimes it will clump up, but that is quite okay. You can shake it and put it into your container just like that. And it will break itself up as you use it. Oh, thank you, Gracie. Thank you. Alright. I'm going to finish mixing this, and I'll come back to show you what to do next. Alright, guys. I have this all mixed up. It's my cornstarch with the lavender essential oil. Thank you. And now I'm going to grab my old salt pepper shaker. I just got this one from the dollar store. I paid a dollar for it. Perfectly works for this purpose. I'm going to spoon this into here and I'll be right back to show you what this will look like. Alright guys, this is what your final product will look like. It's going to be a full jar of homemade baby powder. The best thing that I have realized is that the cornstarch, if your child has a diaper rash, the cornstarch will make it less red and it will also help protect the skin from any wetness. We have been using this on my children for a while now and I absolutely will not use anything else. So, if you have any questions or comments, feel free to comment below or send me a message and I'll answer them as good as I can. I hope you guys have a safe and blessed day from my house to yours.